Bye. Yeah, we had a brutal stabbing here downtown East End by the stabbing tunnel. And you know what's really, really upsetting? is white privileged people, you know, really privileged that don't have to live in this neighborhood and don't have issues. And one of them is the executive of OPS and creates a lot of drug addicts with a lot of crime. And they got our police beats taken away. And I don't think that's fair. I think maybe that young guy might even die because it was such a brutal stabbing in the stabbing tunnel. I mean, what other neighborhood gets a stabbing tunnel except for a native neighborhood downtown? And Ryan Suds, the other poverty pimp, white, you know, privileged, lives even in a real house with his family, comes down here and takes our police beat away. And now our crime is pretty bad. You guys post up signs, hey, no street vendors, but they're there. Um, no security. Why do we not have security when you allow hundreds of people on our block at 40 East Tasty? Right. I remember you, uh, yeah, I think I told you like a whole week later a case about that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we got to make another case because people are getting stabbed and hurt. And people are also getting hurt in my building. Coming into the building attacked. So, um, I'm wondering why the people of color on the city hall don't vote for us to have some safety. You know, senior citizens are in our building. Right, safety at 40. Why could you guys fund these white privileged people that don't live in our neighborhood to take away our police beat? Because you guys said when you guys were going to get hired to be in charge of Vancouver, you're going to bring more police beats. But we didn't get one back. Not after the white privileged people took it away. That's pretty racist. And I don't understand why the people of color on the city hall don't vote for us to have security on our block. You guys are putting hundreds of people on our sidewalk. I have to beg to get the sidewalk clean, which they're doing. Thank you. I should, you know, I shouldn't even have to beg. It should be just like automatic, like across the street. So let's put in a new, you know, complaint. Why do white privileged people that live in nice places come down here, take our cop beats away and make it worse for us to live in. And why do you fund them? And when are we going to get our police beats back? Because you guys know crime's gone up here and attacks have gone up since you guys took our... Listen to white privileged people. You listen to white privileged people and they know there's people of colors on the city hall. Why don't they vote for protection for native people, white people, Jewish people, black people, East Indian people, and Chinese people down here? I believe 40% is probably native, but you guys are hiding that because you guys are racist with the new Google uh, sensory. But I can just look on my street and see that there's way more natives than any other color. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't work for me, you know, because I need more than oh, yeah. that. I'm, I'm, I'm just writing down everything you're saying. Yeah, yeah. I'm just noting it down. You know, I had to phone the police on Sarah Bly for sending her little druggies, you know, to harass a 61-year-old for making videos of the shit show I'm forced to live in, and they make videos here. And do you know, I recorded the conversation from the police and put it on my YouTube channel, and I'm not the only victim. <gasps> that was upsetting. They pick on a 61-year-old government funded. Bullies. Government funded bullies. And they got our police beat taken away from us. You know, that, that stabbing was so brutal. I, I just came back home in complete shock. The yeah, guy I, I was the color that. dead. So you're going to have to make something. Request for our police beat back.
to the white privileged people at the city hall. This is also going on my YouTube channel. Oh, I'd like to make an appointment now that I feel better and I have medication to be able to inhale the urine and the fentanyl down here. I would like to have my name put on to come to the city hall for your guys' little monthly meetings or whatever. You know, because I, I, I have videos, I have, you know, I can bring my laptop and, you know, ask where. Why are, why are the people of color in the city hall acting like white privileged people? Are they colored privileged people? Because there's no privilege down here. Nothing. We have nothing down here except for every day we wake up, we qualify for euthanization. Now that we qualify for euthanization, it reminds me of my heritage, German Jewish. Yeah, I'm pretty upset. I, I expect that we should have a much better neighborhood. Um, can I grab your information so I can send this to, um, and then we have that recorded and I can send you a case reference number? Okay. Uh, 